with this video we're going to kick off the facebook ad section of the course and i'm going to show you effective ad strategies this video is brought to you by epipies academy because most people try ads on facebook and it doesn't work they make no sales so what usually goes wrong i'll tell you right now and you might see yourself if you already tried facebook ads you might see your own experience in this. So people set a budget, maybe they set like, let's say a thousand dollars or a few hundred dollars. They run ads to get in front of potential customers. They carefully go through the step of choosing their audience. They think they targeted it, but those customers don't buy. And then you waste your money and you quit the ads. And then you think the conclusion that Facebook ads don't necessarily work and what's even worse sometimes is like you set a budget for a thousand dollars, you run through like 200 or $300 and then you quit. You just wasted your money and you run an inconclusive test because a lot of people don't have the stomach to lose a lot of money. So what actually went wrong? The issue is that there was a mistake that cold traffic doesn't buy people who don't know you never heard of your business. You think they're going to go and buy stuff from you? No, you've got to warm them up. Turn them from cold to warm. How do we warm them up? There are a few strategies. First, we're going to set up a pixel and run retargeting ads. Pixel is something technical. Basically, a pixel is a little Facebook code that we paste to our site. And by the way, I'll be showing you how to do all of this. I'll do screen sharing and I'll walk you through all of it so you don't have to wonder. But just as a preview, it's basically a code that you'll put on your site and then Facebook will be able to monitor what the traffic you're driving from, from Facebook, what are they doing on your site? And you're going to be able to retarget on Facebook the people who've already visited your site. And because they already clicked on the ad they visited, we need to bring them back because they're warmer leads. This is the first step in warming them up. The problem with this first step with warming them up is that you only have a relatively small audience. Maybe 50 people clicked your site, maybe 100 people clicked your links. And so you got this small audience. And even if you bring them back, let's say maybe a few people buy, that's not enough to build a business on top of that. So we're going to start to build custom audiences and what's called lookalike audiences. So Facebook starts building up a profile of a person who visits your site and does some favorable action. Maybe like out of a thousand people who saw your ad, a hundred people clicked on it, or maybe 50 people clicked on it for this is just for example. And then out of those 50, let's say like 10 people sign up for your email. Well, those 10 people and the numbers might not be exact and Facebook might need a little bit more traffic to build an accurate audience. But those people who perform the desired action on your site, you're going to be able to tap into millions of similar people. That's what it's called. That, that's why they call it lookalike audiences on Facebook. When Facebook builds up a sufficient profile of the exact right lead, they have billions of people on that site. They know a lot about everybody. So they're going to show your next ads to people who most resemble the people who perform the favorable actions. So you're going to start getting better and better leads. And so you, to those better leads, you're going to start running your cold ads to those much better leads. And then you're going to start running your retargeting ads to those very same leads. And you're going to bombard them with the right ads. The right traffic will get the right ads multiple times. And you're going to be able to grow your Facebook business page because a lot of those people are going to also like your Facebook page. And then you're going to be able to also run very cheap ads to people who already liked your page. And that's a recipe for growth because it's always increasing. Always your page is increasing, your traffic is increasing, your email list is increasing, and you can constantly grow that with this level of optimization. So you see this, this is a more of a layered tiered type of ad that you would run than that common mistake of just running ads to cold traffic that doesn't buy. In this case, you will have a far higher chance of them buying in every niche. This works different. It, this works for some niches th this might not work for all niches, but you are going to have a far greater chance for this to work if you follow this formula. And this is what I'm going to sh be showing you for how to set it all up and how to do this 
in the coming videos on Facebook ads.